Welcome back for another Polygon Matic Prize Prediction Analysis and in this video I will be sharing areas that Matic needs to continue holding above for us to continue expecting higher prices and also my pullback target areas and before I do so show some love by first giving this video a thumbs up subscribe to the channel and also check out the channel membership and starting the video here on the 4 hour chart you can easily see that Matic is holding below the 20 day MA here on the 4 hour chart which is now acting as a resistance for us to continue gearing up we also continue to hold above a significant area of support at around the 0 0.6227 mark and as long as you are holding above that there are high chances that in the next coming hours we can get another massive bounce to the upside breaking above resistance at around the 0 0.65 dollar mark and a break above that then we can continue expecting higher prices alternatively in case matic loses this significant area of support at around the 0 0.6227 dollar mark and maybe get a retest then i will be expecting lower prices to the area at around the 0 0.56 dollar mark and all this is based on the Fibonacci. And zooming out on the charts to first give you a recap of what has been happening in the past two weeks here on the Matic chart, you can see that we bottomed at around the $0.49 mark before we saw these massive bonds to the upside in a move that has now given us a high above the $0.66 mark. And using the Fibonacci, since this move has been an impulsive move to the upside, then using the Fibs, connecting the Fibs from the low of, uh, that is the low at around the $0.493 mark to that high at around the $0.6636 mark, I get a minimum target area within which we can expect to see a pullback into in case we lose significant areas of supports. And that is between the FIB level 0.382 and the FIB level 0.618. And that is between the 0.5982 dollar mark and the 0.5577 dollar mark. So in case we lose the 0.6227 dollar mark, maybe with a retest, then we can expect further pullback into this blue target area. Maybe fully maximize the target area, get a low in place, then within the target area we should be able to see a reversal to the upper side breaking above resistance continue gearing up and get above the 0.65 dollar mark in the next coming hours or maybe days or maybe weeks that is the alternative move that you need to have in mind and those are my pullback target areas and now jumping to the daily chart to also give you my long term edu 12 analysis and what i'm expecting on the matic chart once the bull market starts here on the daily chart you can see that matic back in 2020 gave us these lows before we saw that massive push to all-time highs above the 2.9 dollar mark in the formation of this wave one then we started a corrective structure in the formation of that wave two in a move that has now managed to fully maximize the minimum target area for the second wave highlighted on the charts using this red target area which is an area that you fully maximized and there are high chances that in the next coming weeks or maybe months we can see a reaction of these continue getting impulsive and start that impulsive move in the formation of this wave 3 which is a wave that should take us to all-time high once the bull market starts and that move i will be expecting it to get above the five dollar mark and that is based on the trend based Fibonacci where I can connect it from the low of that that is the lows that we made back in 2020 to the all-time high then dragging the Fibs to the bear market low and that now gives me a minimum target area at the Fib level 1. Uh, 1.1618 and that is above the 5.1017 dollar uh, mark and that is the minimum that we can expect Matic to do on the short term and also on the long term and I hope that video was of much help to you.